Okay, I'm going to start something. I've done these before. I got this idea. I'm looking over at my computer here. Hang on. Lyric Lover Crafts. Um, she did a new tutorial on how to make those cute little folders. I made them when I lived in my condo. Or in the condo. It wasn't my condo. Anywho. Um, and... I don't know for sure where they are, but I had fun making them. So I'm going to make some little folders that you can stuff with goodies. And I thought I'd get out this spring market. I went shopping in my stash. This is great, you guys. I'm really kind of getting into this. It's good. The day has come where I'm going to use it. So it's got all these cute... We just, I just got it recently. You want it double-sided. Or you'd have to fill it, which you can do that. Look at this. Isn't that cute? Of course, you know, I like the the boots. Scoot, boot scoot boogie. Um, I got to make these videos. <laughs> I am that parent now. I'm that elderly shut-in person. I mean, I think I called, talked to both of my sons three or four times today. Said to my youngest, I said, you know, it's I'm sorry. I said, it's just that I'm here alone and I need to talk. He said, that's okay, Mom. You know where to find us. I'm like, I sure do. He goes, you know, Brian just lives down the street. He goes, oh, don't worry. I've been bugging him, too. Anyway, um, so I got this and this. I think I'll definitely start with this one. So I will come back. I will show you how to do it. But really, if you want the professional, um, she is awesome, Amber. She does such great, I, oh my gosh, she's just full of great ideas. First thing she said to do, which of course is to cut off, she called it the branding strip, so. Anyway, so it's a true 12 by 12 paper. So I did that. Then, this one's going to be a good one for me to start on because it doesn't have a direction, doesn't have to be in a set direction. Okay, so first score down the middle at six, then at half an inch, oops, got to keep it lined up, Kim, keep it lined up, half an inch, and 11 and a half. Then you turn it, so if it was... If this was directional, you'd want your top to be at this side. And then you do it this at, I wrote it down here on four inches. Okay. And that's all the scoring. Of course, I don't know. I always lose this place, these darn. So I have a bone folder next to me now because, yeah. I'm me. Okay, so I still need my bone folder because I'm going to want to fold. All right, yep, there we go. So I'll use my bone folder and she was saying she called this, um, you know, it's not the thin paper. Let's put it that way. And then I believe I go like this. And score it again. And score at the half inch lines. I think tomorrow while I'm doing paperwork, I'll have my Cricut Joy going. Um, that can be making cards, because i got to finish those so I can share them with my students. Okay, so then... I'm going to want to, I think I'm supposed to cut here and here. I'll be back. I've got to, I got to go watch hers real quick. Hang on. Check this out. I use my new bow. See this, this good, there's good things about this being stuck at home. <laughs> I'm using my stuff. Look at this darling bow I made. Is that not cute? Oh my gosh. So I'm going to make one. So I cut it out already. So you don't have to listen to that. But yeah, you get the center. I don't tend to use the center piece usually. But you get the tail and the butt. 
So I'll just take something and curl it. And then I just use my reptile glue that I showed you earlier. Put a dot. And then hold it. <laughs> These nails are going to be out to here by the time this is over. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. I'll have to remove them myself, I guess, eventually. Oh, that's not holding. Of course, it held when I did it without you guys watching. And then I'll do the other, so I'm pinching them both at the same time. Think smarter, not harder, Kim. Just hold that there. And then I used this, one of these, as the centerpiece. I had these in little um, Ziploc baggies, where how I bought them. And I used this container from, you know where, Tuesday morning. Yeah, baby. Okay. Then I just took the tail and curled it too. I guess nothing earth shattering that I'm doing here. Little dot of glue, little dot'll do ya. She was talking to Margaret and we were laughing about the only crafting she should she's done is make that face mask out of her uh, bra. I she go I go that cracks me up. She goes how many people have I told you? I go oh that's around five thousand. And she goes did you talk about it on YouTube? I go you got it. <laughs> Poor Margaret. Okay so there's that. Aren't these adorable? So cute. And then I'll take one of these little they're like little raindroppy things, little plastic domes. Where am I? There it is, Kim. You can do this. So I'm just going to put that in the center with some glue. Bada bing, bada boom. You move over where people can see it. I got so much crap here. I can't even see what you're seeing. There we go. It's so tiny, you can't see it. And there you go. Hold it down. And that is too cute. I am excited about I was hesitant because I've got a million bow. But this one is nice and small. So you got to have one for every size, for every activity, right? Now I do. So I'm glad I bought it. Okay. I think we've all, as craft hoarders, bought stuff thinking, what if we can ever get to crafts again someday? Well, this is it. This is the day we were preparing for. The lockdown, COVID. Oh, I don't mean to make fun of it because it is very serious stuff. Okay, so I'm loving the new bow. So if you have this, get it out and make some bows. So much fun. I was thinking a sequin could go in the middle of that. A little tiny button. Oh, I love it. Love it, love it, love it. love this thing. I don't set eyelets, but I do use this as a hole punch. What's nice about it is it's so freaking big, you can't lose it. Well, I can, but it's harder. It's harder, easier to spot it. So boy, am I going to miss Miss Emma. Mm. That is going to be one tough situation for both of her and I. We love each other so much. All right. Okay, but it's what we need to do, right? So anyway, I've got four sections. I'm about to complete my first, I think, you know, quarter. And then, so with this being shut down, I think I can pretty much, I should be able to get through it pretty quick, you know, faster than I would have if this hadn't happened. Um, but again, I, I just can't spend my life on that thing. I can't stare at a computer forever. I'm telling you, you know, people think we're so talented as crafters, but really, if you have pretty stickers, 
and paper. Anybody can do what I'm doing right now. But I love it. I love it so. So crafting has always been a good a good thing for me. So I will look later for some twine. So there, this will go <clears throat> in here. And I like to, the last ones, and they've got to be somewhere, that I made, I just took and did themes. So I would take a certain paper pack and just <clears throat> make a folder and then fill it with accessories and little things to go with that match. So just instead of a pocket letter, which maybe we should all start doing those, huh? Remember Pocket Pals? Is anybody doing those anymore? But this is kind of fun because it's a little bit bigger, so you're not limited by that small square. But I have a bunch of those photo sleeve or pocket pal sleeves that I should do. Baseball cards. That was it. So that's my first folder with my first little embelly. Let's see if I do more. I'll share what I do. So here is... I'm trying to keep from saying the word okay. Anyway... Here is some uh, is a tag from the recollections that I've just shown you, and it's black. And this is some of the paper that I screwed up when I tried to make the bottom part, the folder, and cut it wrong. So it's black on black, right? Okay. So let's give this a go. Let's see how wide is this puppy? Uh, a little over two and a half. Two and. Five eighths. Oh, my eyesight's getting bad, people. It's like, oh, that's so By five, a little over five. So two and five eighths, is that what I said? By a little smidge over five. Oh, look at that. I had folded it down a crease. <laughs> so I'll just go like that. Had a meeting, another Zoom meeting. So that is going to be my new connection with the outside world, I guess. Watched another Jimmy Kimmel. God, I love that guy. He's him and Jimmy Fallon are really keeping us all going. It's awesome. What a great idea. Um I don't know if I like that or not. Maybe if I cut. You're going to see me fumbling around. This is how I create, though. Okay, so here's my corner chopper. Let's see if this works. If it doesn't, I'll just tear it off. It's just paper. Oops, see? Oh, yeah, I like that. That's cute. Kind of gives it a trim. So otherwise, it was kind of not fitting. I'll glue that on there. Again, I am not trying to give anybody direction on how to do anything, especially when I can't even keep it in frame. Um, just hanging out. So if you want a tutorial, go to Lyric Lover. She is awesome at tutorials. This is just hang out with Kim time. It's kind of funny. I appreciate it, but I've gone up quite a bit lately in my, I think it's because everybody's home and watching YouTube. <laughs> so I My channel subscriptions or followers are expanding. I've added like, I think it was like 28 in the last few days or last, I don't know. I didn't look at that closely, but that's an honor. I think that's awesome. Okay. Let's see. So now what to do? Let's look at this and see. Of course, I love the boots. But I like to have a saying on everything. Happy little moments, flowers, seeds. Hmm. Oh, I like this one. Sun friends are the sunshine. What does it say? Friends are the sunshine of life. So I'm going to lay that right here. And then I'll probably wish I hadn't and want to pick it up. Because that's how I do. I make a decision and then I go, oops, shouldn't have done that. 
like right now because that's not centered. Let's see if I can get it up. Yes, I can. Okay. Now it's crooked. <laughs> All right. I think it's not this is crooked. The whole darn thing, this whole thing is crooked. So I'm going to have to do something about that. Let's see here. Hmm. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. No, I don't like that either. Um, but up, but up, but up, but up. You guys see something? What should I do? I don't want to do another saying. Let's see what else is in this pack. Maybe the boots. God dang, it's driving me nuts. I swear I see crooked. I really think I do. Is that possible? Is that something? Is that a thing to see crooked? Okay, that's good enough, don't you think? Yeah, we're gonna move on from there. Okay, so now I need to do the back as I flap that over. Hmm, hmm, <laughs> This is cute. I thought I saw one in here that was, but these are, look at the size of this. Like this, I used one of those, but I had to really trim it down because it was no way was it gonna fit. I think I will, hmm. See, I totally, this is what I'm talking about. See how the flaps go wonky in there. Oh, so that gives me an idea. I will do a little pocket. Don't you think? Hmm. Well, or, you know what I think I'll do? I'll just cover this. Okay, that's what I'm going to do. So what did I say? Two and five eighths? <laughs> Why am I laughing? It's not that funny. Okay, a little over five, which that's okay because I didn't end up using it all the way. Two and five eighths. Two and five eighths crooked. So I'll go like this. So what are you all doing to stay sane? Because this is going to be a tough time, people. What happened there? Why did it come out so... <sighs> and now it's rainy here. At least we have nice weather. But on that point, I think it was good that we have the rain because that keeps people in. People go to the beach, they're acting like it's a holiday, and it's not. Okay, so there we go. I'm going to trim just a little bit more. Measure once, trim three times. That's my motto. I'm not understanding this whole, we lock down the state and only essential workers. My son's a construction worker. What the heck? Why is that essential? I don't know. But, like he said, they're probably going to end up shut down just because their companies aren't going to be paying them there to do these jobs. Okay. So I rounded it. And now I'm going to glue it. I need to trim a little more here. Okay. I like it. I'm going to go with it. This is the glue I've been using. It's the reptile glue. Glass, cardboard, PVC, premium. It works on ceramic wood. Anyway, I got it on, you know, my favorite place besides Tuesday morning, Amazon. I know I should do an affiliate link. I tried to set one up and didn't follow through. They said, you haven't sold anything. We're dropping you. Okay, that sounds good. Maybe now that I have time, I could uh, set something up. But the last thing I want to do is find another reason to be other than YouTube. I will go on the computer for YouTube any day, but 
literally yesterday I was on the computer so much, and I probably said this already in my other video, my eyes, you're, I found out you don't blink as much when you're on a computer, so I have to use um, natural tears. It literally felt like my eyes were bleeding. I was like, oh, you know what I just did? I was going to do the green, oh, well, I was going to do the other side. Whatever. This is what happens when you talk and craft at the same time. Okay, so I'm going to go like that. And I... I'm going to just trim it this way. Let's see if that works. If it's laying there, it's fair game. See, that's why I don't really do tutorials, because I don't really have a plan when I start crafting. I just kind of go with it. Okay, so there, I even did that crooked. Okay, I think that'll be pretty. Yeah, it'll be nice. <clears throat> so I'm not going to be doing any work next week not that I'm once I get through it's called IEPs individual education plan for yearly plans and initial I'll have some but I don't know what else I'm supposed to be doing I'm happy to do whatever they want me to do I just need some guidance <laughs> anyway next week none of that and I passed my second test yay or paper finally I have to submit them for my master's, and then they come back and go, no, you need this, or you need that. <clears throat> and I passed it. So I am almost done with the first. There's four sections, and um, I'm looking for my... Hang on. I'll be okay. right There I go again. Okay. <laughs> anyway, I'm putting some videos together. And one of the clips I'm hoping to put in is one of me with this face mask thing on. Yeah, it's going to get ugly, people, if I have to stay home all the time. And in light of that, I don't know how I think. I just don't. I thought, oh, I'll stay home, but I can still see my kids. No, nope. I was mentioning on um, a conference call today or video chat or whatever to a team of people from work. They were like, well, let's not, I don't know why we're doing spring break next week. And I go, well, I'm going to go see my granddaughter. And they go, what? And I go, yeah, you know, I'm just going to go over there and stay there. I won't. They go, no, Kim, you're not supposed to do that. I'm like, oh. And in light of that, they're right. I mean, I don't know. I just thought, well, I'm just driving from my home to their home. I'm not going to get out of the car. Blah, 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 blah. Well, I'm coming from an in very infected area and their area is not so as my other daughter-in-law pointed out you know you're gonna could bring that to a town that didn't have any exposure it's like wow so and a lot of you commented and i do not take offense to that because sometimes you gotta hit me over the head with a pan because <laughs> i was just like oh you know man, why not and then i realized this is serious kim so i'm not and then in talking to Brian and Kristen and Emma and Brian going to work and being exposed every day. And so I was just like, and me being me and, you know, I'm staying in. But like today I went grocery shopping, so I could have contracted. Is that what you say? Gotten it there, you know. I mean, I did go grocery shopping. Um... Anyway, and I don't want to bring any illness to them, and I don't want to get the illness from him. This is tough. I mean, because that was one of my lifelines is my kids down the street and Emma. So, wow. It just, uh, I'm not going to cry. I refuse to cry. I can do this. We can do this. We got to hang together. Um, I've stocked up on ice cream. I even got milk and cereal, some of my favorites, half a pie, Bertolli's, boy, that frozen Bertolli's, if you get those meals, they're awesome, so I got that, I made, you know, got oranges, I got my multivitamin, which are not easy for me to find because I have this weird thing where I'm allergic to lake, yellow, I think I've mentioned this before, yellow day, lake dye number six, We've, my doctor figured that out, I break out of big welts and itch all over. So, it's hard to find um, 
you know, pills that don't have a dye in them to make them look pretty. So nature made, those kinds are okay. So I wasn't able to find that at Wally World. Um, so I got yummies. You needed to know that. But anyway, so I'm stocked up. I think I'm good. I will be going to the post office either tomorrow or the next day. Um, so yeah, other than that, I ain't going to place. So I did get the Michaels. I ordered online and they did curbside. They brought it to my car. So I didn't even go in the store. You can't buy the hot buy paper pads that way. But somebody had shown Blooming Tag pad. So I did get that. But again, I did not go in the store. Got it. I'm sure that was probably still wrong, but anyway, I'm just being honest. That's what I did. But what somebody pointed out is these are ready. You can take these out. So they are ready to come out. Is that cool or what? So I got that pad. Now I got that loose. Um, yeah, they're all like that. Holy mackerel. That's really cool. Oh, look at that. The swan. Why do we have a thing about swans? What is that? Oh, look at these with the letters on them. So I believe that I was asking the gal, I go, are you guys shutting down? She goes, she's so cute. She goes, I'm not sure if we're considered an essential service. And I'm like, I'm with Michael. She goes, you know, homeschooling parents and stuff. And I go, I don't think so. Because TJ Maxx was closed next to them. Our governor called it quits starting tomorrow I believe he had 48 hours warning anyway so I'm thinking oh, I don't think so so I ordered this before they did the major shutdown um so yeah these are pretty oh not all of them okay no so when you get toward the back they are no longer you have to do the old-fashioned fussy cut them out creaks so yeah oh look at these cute little squares I love it so yeah, I did get that. And that is the Tags in Bloom, or Blooming Tag Pad, rather. Because, oh, I just thought I wanted it. All right, so I have been watching a lot of Lyric Lover, and she is awesome. I made some of these a while back, these little folders that you can make. And before I moved out of the condo, into here and I'm not sure where they are now because you know I packed it all up and left quickly <laughs> you couldn't wait to get to a bigger place thank you that I don't have I'm so thankful that I'm in my a bigger space and I don't have people living above me I can do this here this is doable I have a front porch anywho okay so I made one of these when you love what you have you have everything you need isn't that awesome and that is from that pack that I recently got from Tuesday morning. A bunch of those got us. That springtime, spring market. So I would plan to make, um, I'll leave a link to her video because I tried to make a <laughs> tutorial. This part screwed me. I kept cutting it the wrong way. Anyway, so there's little flaps. Lyric lover Amber. She does a great job of explaining how to do these. So I'm going to, though, I will make some tags with you and some things to fill it with. Right? Oh, these will fit. So I have those over the whole over the door holders. And I was laying in bed. And I went, oh, look at that. I have these. These are graphic 45, I think. Don't they look like graphic 45? I don't know. Anyway, so these would be cute in there. I saw some tags in there in that little holder. These are nice. These are Timmy. These are tough stuff. This is like a board, etc. So, getting into this. I'm doing it. So, I will craft with you. Why not? Okay? So, I'll be right back. Hey, everybody. I finished, I'm putting together a bunch of videos. I really don't know what I've shown. I haven't gone back and watched them. So if I repeat myself, yeah. Anyway, I made, and I told in another, this is the one from Lyric Lover. 
this idea, and she does these folders, and I used, I found the, this right here. And so yeah, very fun. I think it turned out really pretty. I made this tag using those recollection um, black. And I showed me making that. And I made these bows. Oh my gosh, my new bow of love. I'm so glad I got it because I felt guilty when I got it. But it's small. I do have bow makers. I don't believe I have this one. I've checked and I don't see it in any of my many, many boxes of... I know, it's ridiculous. But anyway, so what's nice is it makes a tiny little bow. And you can have it be straight out or kind of fold it in half and have it be coming down which I'm really enjoying that and I think I showed yesterday this so today I did a meeting and I first I had my first meeting this morning so far I haven't had to set them up that's tomorrow <laughs> via this zoom app anyway so, wish me luck for that. I guess both sides will give me something to look at while I... Anyway, so, but I had forgotten I had signed up for one. And I'm gonna, I'm making burgers at home because I'm a fast food junkie and I'm not doing fast food. So, right now, junk food. Anyway, so I was toasting a bun in the broiler in my oven. All of a sudden, I went on my um, school computer, and I went, oh, my God, I'm supposed to be in a meeting 10 minutes ago. So I run upstairs where my other good computer, I don't like my school, anywho, and I'm up here, and I'm smelling, <laughs> I turned the burner off, huh, no, it was the broiler. So I will try to, like I said, I'll try to insert a, a picture of the buns. Luckily, they did not catch on fire, but I threw them outside so the smoke alarm wouldn't go off and then I quietly came back to the meeting. I was just there to listen as an admin designee. That's scary. Anyway, so I didn't, wasn't like contributing any information, so I was just kind of there. So yeah, Lucille Ball does internet conferencing what the heck okay so oh and then I was out out shopping in my garage <laughs> and I found these cute little envelopes so I put that one on this side with red line tape and decorated it up and I don't have anything in there yet so there you go there's my little folder that I think would be fun to give someone so that is that and um I think I'll call this one good because there's a lot I'm putting into this one so I will pull, try to pull it all together if it's in the wrong order or whatever be patient I hope you all are doing okay this uh isolation thing is gonna be tough but we can do it let's hang in there and I will be back with more videos don't you worry bye okay so, it's the coronavirus. <laughs> I blame it. <laughs> I got this around Christmas time. There was this treasure hunt thing at work. And this was in the bag. Because I found one of the numbers or letters or I don't know what it was. Anyway. So, this is what you do when you're really bored and hold up for a quarantine. Or, I'm not in quarantine, but you know, self-inflicted we're all to stay inside. And so I'm doing this. This is only day two that I have completely stayed home and not gone anywhere. If we do this for like months, it ain't gonna be pretty. <laughs>